When you're testing your report or when you're finally ready to print your report, you will be associating your journal and format templates with an event frame. Let's take a detailed look at the event frame that we will be using for our report. Each video will then start by introducing what part of this event frame will be teaching you how to pull into your report. Here's an example of event frame search in PySystem Explorer, and we have a few event frames. Let's take a look at event frame 2160, and there are some associated child event frames, and even one of those has another level of child event frames. These are the event frames that we'll be reporting on, so let's take a detailed look at their attributes and associated units. At the first level of our event frame, we're using a template called Procedure, and this corresponds to what you might also know as a pie batch level. This level by default has static attributes of product and recipe. Under this are some child event frames. In this case, we have mixing steps and a heater step. And the templates associated with these are at the unit procedure level, which you also might know as a pie unit batch. These by default have static attributes of batch ID, procedure, and product. And then finally, we have one sub batch level under the heater step because we have two heater elements, which are turned on for various amounts of time. And these are at the operation level, which by default don't have any static attributes. You might also know this as one of the sub-batch levels. In addition to the default static attributes, our mixing step event frame template has PyPoint data references referring to a Py tag that has the pH measurement for each of our mixing steps. Our heater elements also have custom attributes that refer to temperature measurements that are pie tags. Also, our child event frames are associated with AF elements. In this case, mixing step one has a link to mixing unit one, and it has a custom attribute holding the serial number. While mixing step two is associated with mixing unit two, also with an associated serial number. Our heater step has been associated with heater unit one with a custom serial number attribute, as well as a PyPoint data reference for the total current. And our heater element child event frames under our heater step also have associated heater element AF elements. And these have custom AF attributes, PyPoint data references for the current of each of the two elements. Looking back at PySystem Explorer, you can see that these are also known as the primary element. Now that you have a better understanding of the event frame of interest, the default and custom attributes we'll be reporting on, and the associated units, I'll be starting each video with this slide and detail which items I will be reporting on in that particular video.